I'm gonna be reacting to the Braxton's so you guys will be seeing these videos for today Make sure you like comment subscribe and share and turn on my post notifications so you guys don't ever miss one post and Let's get into the video Today is, you guys, sorry about that. Today is September 7th, as you guys know. It has officially been two months, um, so I will be giving you guys an update, you know, on my situation um, pertaining to my mom and stuff. So you guys will uh, be uh, giving an update on that too. So um, let's get into the video.
I've definitely enjoyed this song, you guys. I hope you enjoyed it just as much as I did. Making it for you. <clears throat> I'm going to get my words together. Okay, so um, I definitely enjoyed this performance. Um, I think this was the time, I, well, I think this was around the time when um, Tracy wasn't in the group because she was having a baby at this particular time. So I think this the reason why she didn't like participate in the song and stuff like that because I think this was the time she uh, wasn't in the group and I guess they just decided to like uh, just sign the record deal without her and which became a trio so um, now that I look back on this video I feel like this well I won't say this I feel like that's the reason why Tracy wasn't in this uh, this uh, video at all the times I watched it you know, I just never thought of the reason why Tracy was in the video. But now that I look at it, it's very clear that I feel like she probably wasn't a part of the video because she was pregnant at this particular time. So it seemed like they decided to just um, sign the contract without uh, Tracy. Now, I don't know. Now, the thing is, the thing is that our question is that I don't know how far along she was because I feel like if she was kind of like early in her pregnancy or whatever i feel like maybe they shouldn't have signed but it was never clear or denied on how many months she was at that particular time you know but um i definitely enjoyed uh this reaction from them and i also um read too well and heard that um at this particular time uh Tony, you know, she was just uh, breaking into the music industry, you know, well, about this time, Tony was already, you know, kind of like, you know, big at this particular time anyways, because I think she got signed in like 1993, I would want to say 1993 or 1994. I know it's somewhere in that range or whatever, but um, I feel like uh, I think Kenny Babyface, they already said uh, that they had signed uh, some group. Or some group was already signed. I don't know if it was like uh, TLC or something like that. It was some some. It was a group like like that. You know, it was another trio group that they said that they had signed or was signed or whatever. And um, I guess that uh, they didn't want to sign the Braxtons because they had already uh, signed whatever group that they was talking about at that particular time and i'm guessing that group was kind of a little bit more bigger than the, the braxton's or whatever but i definitely enjoyed this performance uh, i wish they made more music together uh you know when they was younger and stuff i also of course wish uh tracy was a part of it uh i kind of just feel at the same time too you know i wish they never would have signed without Tracy because I feel like you know eventually like a person not gonna you know be pregnant forever so you know I felt like they should have just gave her a fair chance I felt like they should have just kind of like waited because sometimes waiting in life can also present better opportunities that can also present just better things for you just better things for everybody far as a group and sometimes when you're moving too fast it don't turn out the way you want it to and it may never come to a good uh conclusion sometimes when you get into some sometimes it just stays that way sometimes it just stay bad forever you know so i felt like tracy was mad about that and upset about that for so many years you know even in her adult life you know which i understood where tracy you know was coming from because you know always watching tracy she's never been the violent type of person she always been like the equality person where she's rooting for everybody she want everybody to win she want everybody to succeed and stuff like that but i just kind of feel like you know when it always came to her it kind of was always like the short end of the stick if that makes sense but i definitely enjoyed this performance you guys they did amazing 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 phenomenal good job they still sound the same now today as they did 20 some years ago when this first came out but um with that being said make sure you follow me on my instagram be in the link in the description in the bio i haven't been on that much lately you guys my instagram but you guys still can follow um and make sure you like comment subscribe and share to my post notifications so you guys don't ever miss when i post and um well yeah peace
Oh, and I liked this song, and I, I'm not trying to make the video too long, guys, but I also liked this song because I feel like this was like one of the songs, because I, you know, of course, this was when, the, you know, Braxton's went solo and became a trio, and, you know, Tony was a, you know, solo artist and stuff, but I also feel like this gave a chance to show the Braxton's voices individually and just them as individually people if that makes sense and i got and, and i not got but i like the fact that you know later in life i like the fact that even though tracy wasn't a part of her sister's group the braxton's in this lifetime when this was released i like the fact that she didn't give up on her creativity and years later she came out with her her own album so um i definitely were just grateful to just hear tracy's voice when she was alive god rest her soul and she got to put out the creativity that she wanted and the creativity that she wanted to go for in the direction that she wanted to go for for her music so i definitely wish she would have got a chance to come out with another album uh it would have been very good to see and uh just rest in peace to Tracy and um yeah you guys we out